guys welcome back to another episode of going medieval so we just about got this whole building done there's a few things that i still want to do um in time and that's work on the first floor windows get that all uh decorated a little bit differently i will be replacing them with the uh stone ones or limestone uh block ones so that'll look a little bit different and i might even uh replace these parts not sure if um, it's doubled. I think it's just the first exterior ones. Yeah, so we'll be replacing those as well, I think, with the stone bricks. And then we'll decorate it a little bit better just to make it look a little bit nicer. And then it's not just like this one huge um, wooden blob, <laughs> per se. But we do need to get the um, parts up here finished uh, where the stairs and stuff are. So... We'll be working on that, trying to get this part done, and then we can finally get on to another project. Don't know if we'll start a new project today, but it will be a good start. So we'll start with these parts here. And I think we can even do up to where this window is before we need to... Um, get them to come up on to the top here and place them down so we'll do that and we'll just select that we'll choose the wooden one all right so that's basically what it will look like when it's complete which isn't too bad it's not too much different than what it looks like over here so yeah it'll be good um i'm not sure when or how long it'll take until to get the roof and stuff on, but um, we'll see if we can't get our um, dogs to transport some of these bricks over there. Just keep it fully stocked. We don't have that many bricks at the moment. I'm not sure where all of them are. Oh, we're still making some. Okay, we're going to need more clay too, I think. We'll see if we can't mine out some more clay. Yeah, I'll tell them to mine that out. And maybe this part right here too. And that should help with the uh, clay demand. Okay, and then we have that roof part up here too.
right, so we got most of the roof on. Uh, we'll be able to finish this up um, underneath now. I think that they were already doing it underneath, actually, over on this part, so we probably didn't need to leave that open, but that's all right. Uh, we'll go ahead and tell them to finish this off then, and then we can start working on the roof up there uh, once we get the main roof done. So uh, we'll... Just finish this up by going like this, and we'll bring that all the way over here. We'll bring that all the way over there, and then we'll just tell them to select that. We'll do the um, wooden part like we were doing, and then that part should be good. We'll just need to uh, get that part of the roof on, and then it should be good to go. So, yeah, it's taken a few days to actually work on, but it looks really good for the most part. Um, the only thing that I want to change is the first floor um, material for the um, these parts here between the windows and the windows themselves. And I think we can do uh, spend some stone bricks on that, um, make it a little bit more um, less woody, you know, just like kind of more of a stone texture. I think that would look better, honestly. The doors will unfortunately still have to be the same color, but that's all right. I don't think it would really work well if it was like a stone door. <laughs> that would be really hard to open and close, I think. But yeah, all right, so that's good. We got that all being worked on, so it shouldn't take too, too long. Looks like they can reach it from underneath. That's great. All right. I don't know if we're going to have enough bricks down here. Probably want to restock on those as well. So we'll go over here. Ooh. What do we have here? Dead wolf. Haul that in. Can always use that. Ooh, there's a lot of wolves actually. Probably go hunting again. A few foxes over here too. A couple dead things. We'll grab these, bring them in. Uh, I'm not sure if there's anything else. We'll keep an eye our eye open for it and see if there's anything else that we can grab. Pretty sure that would be it though.
Great, so I'm pretty impressed with how the, the side looks. It looks a lot better than just the wood, I think. So we'll be replacing the f entire first floor with just stone bricks, I think, for the uh, windows and walls. Doors, obviously, we can't do, but that's okay. Um, it won't matter too much. It will just kind of make it look a little bit more like there's an actual entrance there, so that will help a little bit more, I guess. But the, yeah, we're going to need a lot of stone bricks, I think. So I resumed production on them, and I'm not sure if we're going to have enough stone, limestone to work on that. Uh, a little hard to tell if we have extra laying around or not. That's dirt. I'm um, not sure what stockpile this is. It says material. Raw sticks. So, would that be limestone? Limestone pile one, yeah. So, we don't have any extra limestone laying around. And it's winter, so it's a little bit hard to see where all the limestone is. So, oh, there's some over here we might be able to mine. Yeah, we'll mine that out. Okay, that's coal. Okay, so that will help a little bit, I think. Let's see if we can't mine some more out. So that's that's actually silver. Iron. Limestone. That's silver. Silver. We might as well mine the silver. Yeah, so we'll do that. Not sure if they can get down there. Uh, that's good question. Yeah, they can. We put stairs in. Alright, so that should help. There, we also have a cold snap at the moment, so it's like everything's like freezing. <laughs> Some of our settlers are uh, cold as well. But we got a pretty good amount of bricks. I think we'll be able to get that part all built. So we'll um, use these corner sections for the parts like this. And that's basically what I've been doing, is I've just been using the corner sections and then flipping that onto the other side. Like that. And then that looks good. So we'll be doing that uh, for all of the parts around the exterior here. And then we'll put the windows and stuff in too. Great, so I got our main cooks moved into their new bedrooms and they're all up on the top floor. I also put a entertainment area in for backgammon 
which um, if we move the roofs, you can kind of see down here, we got a couple entertainment things. I'm also putting some candles in here uh, just to decorate the room a little bit more, just wooden ones, but it will still be nicer than uh, having a dark room. And these ones, uh, that one's considered modest. Uh, this one is considered good. And I'm not sure about this one. This one's modest. I'm um, not sure how to improve it. I think it's the space requirement. So I'm not too sure how I can improve it too much more. But um, we'll work on that a little bit more uh, next episode. Maybe add some banners or something to um, decorate the walls or something with. But we'll see if we can't get that up to good uh, like the other one. And we'll work from there. But there's still that bear that we need to hunt. So um, we'll probably take that on next episode, I think. And try to get a another thing. I don't know where the bear actually went. <laughs> was around here somewhere i saw it there it is it's right there so also sent a caravan out to a region to trade so that's going to take a couple days so we'll probably wait until they come back and then we'll bring the donkeys in and then we'll um take on that bear so or we could do it now i don't know like next episode when before they get back but outside of that if you are new to my channel don't forget to subscribe come down below rate the video and i will see you guys next time thanks for watching peace out